Hey, I'm gonna show you guys how to make a YouTube short with your editor on your PC, or you can also use it on console as well. There is a website that will resize your videos and clips and send them up there. And if you are a streamer on Twitch, there is a new tool to where it will upload your clips straight up onto YouTube for YouTube short and TikTok. I do believe TikTok as well on there. So, uh, yep, let's all get ready and get right into it. There are two things to make a YouTube short. It has to be within 60 seconds. I always like to make mine within like 59, 58 seconds because I like to put a subscribe now title at the end or hit the like title at the end or my logo, anything you want. And another thing, every title for a YouTube short needs to have hashtag shorts in it. Oop. Or it won't work. You know, you can also put hashtag shorts, hashtag your gaming name, hashtag your what company name, anything. Hashtag Warzone, hashtag Battlefield, who cares, you know, all that. But hashtag shorts needs to be in there or will not upload as a short. You'll have a random vertical video in your YouTube that won't get uploaded at all. And right now is a huge time to start uploading shorts because... You can make that video that just goes viral overnight, you know? You really don't know. Uh, but those two things are a must. So I know Xbox is completely different from uh, PS PlayStation. Uh, on PlayStation, you're going to need to download the Capture Gallery. And on the Capture Gallery, you can upload your clips and videos to YouTube. But whenever you do it on YouTube, you want to put it unlisted. All right, because this is if you don't have a PC, laptop, or anything. You're just a console player, and you want to upload your clips. All right, I'm going to show you how. If you have a smartphone, all right, and this is for Xbox, too, but Xbox is a little bit easier because you can look up your clips right off the app, okay? If you don't have the Xbox app, download it now, and then you can look up your clips and everything. You can record them right from your phone. So PlayStation is going to be the same thing, but there's an extra step there, okay? Whenever you upload it, to YouTube unlisted of course that'll make sure no one can see it you're gonna download it from YouTube to your phone and from your phone I recently found that that same app Capwing Studio you can take your download from your phone to the Capwing Studio on your phone and then you can make your video that way okay uh, same way you uh, Xbox as well. You could use the cap wing or you can use an iMovie on iPhone. Uh anything like that, you know, anything other things you find, but that's the way you got to do it from PlayStation to Xbox. They're a little bit different, but remember PlayStation you download it the ga the capture gallery, then after you get the capture gallery, every clip will be stored on there. And you go into there, you upload it from YouTube, unlisted, then you download it from YouTube to your phone. So many steps. But you got it. Let's try this out. We're going to try to upload a file here. So, uh, there's a OneDrive right here. Alright, let's try this. Alright. So this is a free video editor online that you could use to make a YouTube short. <clears throat> so while that uploads, I'm just going to try to show you. Probably crop this. So this is why it's going to hear snap story right here. Boom. So to give you an understand, this is probably one of the easiest ways you probably could just upload a YouTube short. You know, I'm sure you can move this, you know. I'm sure there's so much more you could do. Done cropping. There we go. Here's our final product. Boom, bada bing, bada boom, you know. All right. So, if you have a PC or anything, you can actually take, like, or, I mean, on Xbox, right? So, on Xbox, you can add, download the Xbox app, and the Xbox app will let you look at all your clips, everything. So, you can actually record those clips from your phone, <clears throat> upload them to a OneDrive. Or just upload them straight from here. Actually, pretty legit to me. I mean, this is actually pretty nice. This is my first time ever seeing this, and this is pretty cool. Now, if you don't have a video editor, or if you don't have access to a computer, but you do have a smartphone, 
well. You can actually watch your clips on your phone, record them from your phone, and then you can upload them that way. You know, uh, there's probably not... There, <laughs> there probably ain't that much that you could do with it, but, you know, uh, there. I know on iPhone there's a thing called iMovie, and you can edit, split, you know, cut, whatever, crop, video, everything. You know, you can do everything on there. Uh, so... I'm just trying to show you guys there are other ways you, without PCs just, you know, that you can upload and make YouTube shorts. I'm going to add a few more <clears throat> uh, clips here just to give you an idea. So every time you want to add one, you want to go in the keyframes, you know, right here. Uh, you can either look on this one, see what the keyframe's at. The height's at 0 0.991. The width's at, all right. Usually whenever you do that, so we're going to go here, 0 0.991. So I want it to look the same, you know. Hit enter, boom, directly on. Make sure it's good, there ain't no gaps in the bottom. All right. Like it. You see how this one right here has a little gap at the bottom? You know, sometimes if you get them close, it doesn't hurt just to... Put it right down in there, or it doesn't even matter because on YouTube Shorts, your subscribe button's gonna be there. You know, that's a big deal. So, <clears throat> again, this is uh, CyberLink Power Director 365. You know, it's actually a really good editor. All right, so that one's on there. Boom. All right, let's go. So we're gonna take the video we don't need. Boom. Stop it on. Stable. So watch how it just snaps in now. Boom, right to the next one. Ding, 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 ding. Fry the guy off the back. back. I got this guy twice. Money. From, let's say this is the end video. So from here, you know, you obviously want to go back and check your stuff. Uh, after you edit the video, like cut it, you know, uh, and you have it to where you want it, and it's final. You can add your sound effects, your transitions, your uh, whatever. As you guys see, I'm adding these last sound effects right now, and I'm gonna show you the final of the video. So let's do that right now. You never want to like overdo it with the sound effects, but enough to death. You know what I mean? He said, no, why? He was stunned to kill me. <laughs> there you have it. Uh, whenever you guys, like, the music is honestly one of the best things you can add to these videos. And uh, whenever you do it, like I said, make sure it's low, like the lowest it can go because it'll sound different as you're editing than it will be at, on a YouTube video. Like, things are a lot more louder, okay? And, uh, if you guys are ever looking for music without getting, you know, copyright, you can go right on the YouTube, right here. Show you. Thanks, bro. <laughs> without teamwork. So, let's go here. Uh, edit video. Okay, it's not it. So we're gonna hit back. So we're in here, okay? Uh, I'm gonna go down the audio library. And here you go. These are all the songs, music, sound effects, everything you can use without getting copyright strike. And they got a lot of good tracks on there. Uh, they do.
So this one here is one that added in June. Thank you for watching you guys uh please don't hesitate to comment ask me anything i will answer back uh if you guys need any help please don't hesitate to ask uh other than that have a great day be blessed be thankful be humble i'll see you guys in the next one have a great day